Good morning, my beautiful people. Happy new month. It is Monday, June 1st. We're about to embark on the 245 mile challenge. It is currently 5.35 a.m. I have to get up early because this whole week is gonna be very hot. So the earlier I get out, the better it's gonna be for me. So stay tuned to join me on this journey. I'm excited to share the whole experience with you guys. Let's get it. Let's go, baby. Three, two, one. We have a lift off. Let's go. Hey guys, so we just started the run. The goal is to cover as many miles as possible throughout the day, but be comfortable enough that I don't feel like I can't go tomorrow. So it's not about going quick at all. Pace is not a factor. It's about, pace is a factor, but pace going fast is not the factor. It's about covering miles. That's what it's about for the next whatever days, all right? Let's go. Mile five, mile five. We are just getting started. Mile five, let's go. It's a beautiful morning, nice and cool. Mile seven, we are mile seven in. So no matter what, that was gonna get done. So technically, we just started the journey because either way, that seven miles, that daily minimum, was gonna get done. And we got that done. Mile seven, let's get it, let's go. Mile 10, we are 10 miles in, mile 10. Maybe uh, we'll stop soon. We are feeling very good so far. I have all these like electrolyte popsicles and and I don't even know, but I'm about to eat around it and have my, uh, just refuel. Quick little break and now we're about to continue. Let's go. You hear that? Don't stop, hey. Don't stop. Mile 15. Mile 15. What's up, guys? Um, I'm doing my best to stay around the three time I was running in the last three years because I'm familiar with it. But uh, I just take this turn down this block. As I'm turning around, this lady from her house whips out her phone, clearly, so obviously, pointing it at me. And she's recording me. So I was like, hey, can you please not record me? What's going on? I just said that, but it was weird. She's like, literally to my face. But whatever, as long as I'm good and safe, I'm good. Just wanna share that with you guys. So, a lot of people are being extra friendly to me. I really appreciate it. I think they're trying to show their support about what's happening. And uh, they're white individuals. And uh, all I give them is a big smile back. And letting them know that I know that, that they, they, they know that my life matters. So thank you guys. Thank you. We gotta stick together, no matter what. Does not matter what color your skin is. All right, let's get it. Mile 20, mile 20. We just completed mile 20. Mile 20, baby, mile 20. What's up, guys? I'm about to do my David Goggins impersonation. What's up, guys? Whatever you wanna do in life, you can't just sit down on the couch. You gotta dig in, you gotta get up and find what it is that you want and make no excuses and get after it. Do you think life is easy? Life will never be easy. All right, stay hard. <laughs> <laughs> Much love to you, David Goggins, that was for fun. Mile 25, mile 25, mile 25, let's get it. What's up, guys? We just completed 26.43 miles at 9.40 pace, four hours, 15 minutes. And the best part is only 10.42 a.m. The reason I'm home is because I got a virtual training session back to back, two people at 11. So I gotta get that done. We're gonna rest, take our sweet time because we got plenty of time in the day and see if we can get out later and get a few more miles in. Thank you for coming along. Let's keep going. Let's get it, let's go. We recovered. We trained, and now we're about to go run. We're trying to get to 35 miles today, nice and easy. See y'all, let's get it, let's go. Mile 30, mile 30, mile 30, mile 30, let's go, let's go. Mile 30, mile 30. Man, not having that backpack on makes a huge difference. It was like getting heavy and heavy by the miles, but now I feel free. Mile 35, day one is in the books. I feel really good. 
it was the perfect balance because we got plenty of days to go. See y'all tomorrow. Let's get it. Let's go. Good morning, my beautiful people. It is day two that we're about to start. I feel a little better today because I got a little more sleep. Yesterday I only got two hour and a half of sleep. Today I got an extra two hour of sleep on top of that. So I feel better. We're about to get it going. Stay tuned. Let's get it. Let's go. Three, two, one. Let's go. Good morning. We're just starting day two. Um, so this time I didn't take my backpack with me. I'm just gonna go like five miles around to come back home. Like in the, each five mile increment at home so I can refuel, drink, eat, go back out because that backpack I took with my bottles and all that stuff in it um, ended up being tough later. So we're changing the tactic up a little bit today. We'll see how it goes. Let's go. Mile 40. Mile 40. Let's get it. Mile 40. Mile 45. Mile 45. Done. Mile 45. We are on the, we are on the verge of mile 50. And uh, I'm starting to cramp in my abdominal area. Right now, leg is fine, but I'm cramping a little bit on my core. So we're gonna keep pushing. I'll keep you guys up to date. Let's go. Mile 50, mile 50, mile 50, 50, 50, 50. I can't pronounce 50. It sounds like I'm saying 15, but mile 50. Update, no more cramps. Went away, we're good. So we're pushing for mile 55. Let's go. Mile 55. We're about to do the last run of the first segment of the day, then we're gonna shower, nap for a while, and then go up, and go out for the last segment. I'm so excited to get today's done with, completely. Let's go. Mile 60, mile 60, baby. Let's go, mile 60. Show that. You can still into my shoes already, guys. I don't heel strike, but I drag my foot when I'm going slow. So, and it's only been two days. Might have to use other shoes eventually. I don't know, we'll see. We'll see. What's up guys? Just a little update on how I feel right now. Um, I didn't, I thought my legs were fine, so I started kneeling like this, and I felt that soreness go through my quads, but energy-wise, it's getting low because eventually that's gonna happen. We covered 26.5 miles so far today. I'm gonna shower, rest, eat, and take a nap, and then knock out the rest later today to get to 35 miles. Um, yeah, so feeling fine. It's only day two, guys. It's only day two, so we'll know the real deal around day three, day four, midway through. So stay tuned for more. Let's get it. Let's go. What's up, my beautiful people? I'm just beautiful. Just kidding. What's up, my beautiful people? We got 8.5 miles to go. We completed 26.5, and then we're at 35 miles for the day, and we call it a day, and we get out tomorrow, and we get after it. Let's get it. Let's go. Mile 65. Mile 65. Mile 65. Let's get it. It's taking forever. We got a little spring in. And a little spring left. We're almost there. Yeah. Running slow is much harder, but if you run fast, you won't last long. That's crazy. But you run slow, you'll last long. But you're gonna be in some pain, I tell you. Mile 70, mile 70. Day two is a wrap. Ah, ah. Day two is a wrap. We finished our 35th mile for the day. 70 miles total. Thank you for watching. See y'all tomorrow. Let's get it, let's go. What's up my beautiful people? Good morning. We're about to start day three. As of right now, mentally I feel better. Physically, I don't know. We'll put it to the test soon. And uh, we completed 70 miles. We're about to begin and get 35 in today. Also, I changed my shoes today. The, the hokas are kind of like starting to get beat up and then um, it's getting weird on my feet. So I'm just gonna change to the pure boost and see how that feels. I might change back to hokas later though, but we don't know. We'll see. All right, see you guys soon. Bye. 
Mile 75, mile 75, mile 75. The sun is shining on me. The sun is shining on me. It's a blissful feeling. Oh, amazing, amazing. We got off today. Be able to run today. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Woo. Mile 80, mile 80 in the books. Mile 80. We're gonna wrap it home and uh, recover, drink some water, and gel, have some gel, eat a bagel with cream cheese, vegan of course, and then we chill, we go back out of it. We go back out there again. Let's get it, let's go. Okay, so we went back home and we ate, we changed, and uh, we changed the shoes too. I had to go back to the hookahs because um, the other shoes were really comfortable and light, but it's like cardboard and uh, no shock absorbent. It's not shock absorbent at all. And I felt that on my joints. So hookahs back on and uh, let's go. Sweating like crazy already. It hasn't been even half a mile. Hey guys, so I just ran into a neighbor of mine and he goes, you smile too much for the amount of time that you run. And I'm just like, sometimes that's the only way to get through it. You gotta smile through the pain. That's how you gotta do it. Let's go. Mile 85, mile 85. Mile 90, mile 90, mile 90, baby. We are going for mile 95. Um, I feel drained mentally. Physically, I'm okay. But um, I tried to change my shoes this morning and it was a bad idea because the pure boost was like cardboard compared to this and I felt the shock in my joint. So we're back with the hookahs. We're about to tackle mile 95. See y'all after mile 95. I was dropped off far away from home and it's raining and I'm about to run home just to change the scene up a little bit you know it gets pretty boring riding running around the same area all the time that's it let's go mile 95 mile 95 we just completed mile 95. We got 10 more to go for the day. Uh, I'm hungry. I'm gonna chill a little bit and then knock the rest out later. Let's get it. Keep watching, stay tuned, okay? Don't forget to leave, all right? Don't forget to leave, don't forget to stay. Don't forget to stay. See, I'm so delusional right now. Shout out to the camera lady. Sorry guys, see you soon. 10 miles to go, we're about to start that journey now. Got a good nap in and I uh, finish out the rest of the day, so stay tuned. I'll see y'all soon. I'm tired still, but just gotta get it done. Gotta get it done. Mile 100. Mile 100, y'all. Mile 100! Mile 105. Mile 105. Mile 105 done. We completed day three. Thank you for tuning in. I appreciate you guys. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Let's get it. Let's go. Good morning, my beautiful people. Welcome back. We're about to start day four. Um, I put on my Nike Pegasus again because it's much more comfortable right now. The hookahs are killing my left foot. Um, the side of it, even putting it on to walk, it hurts. But when I put this on, it's a little more or less painful. But um, I can feel the impact on my joints with these versus the hookahs. But we're gonna give it a go. I'll see you guys later today. Let's get it, let's go. Hey guys, my legs feel good, sore, which should be expected, but um, nothing like, oh, this is really tough. But the thing is, my foot is in pain. I don't, oh, I can't even explain it. It feels like someone cut it with blade, but there's no cut, obviously. And uh, and I felt like because my foot was, it was sliding in the hookahs to the edge, my right one, that's what caused it. But we're wearing the Nike Pegasus. It's much more comfortable. Hopefully we can make it through today with that. If not, I'll let you guys know. All right, I'll talk to you soon. Let's get, let's go. Mile 110, mile 110. Mile 115, mile 115. 
I had to run barefoot right now with socks because the hookers are killing my the hookers are killing my right foot and it doesn't hurt my other shoes my foot doesn't hurt but I feel the impact on my joints more so I'm just gonna have to sacrifice the joint impact a little bit and go shorter at a time yeah so running back home barefoot <laughs> I had to switch shoes let's try this again we got the Pegasus on Pegasus Pegasus all right let's go see you guys electrolyte time gotta force myself to to hydrate it's really hot today so <laughs> Mile 120. Mile 120. Let's go. Let's get it. Let's go. Mile 125. Mile 125. We are out to tackle mile 130. Chaining my shoes up again. I'm wearing the Ultra Boost. Those are all much comfortable right now than the Hoka Zone. I don't know why, but um, yeah. So it's hot today. Today's really hot. It's currently 87 degrees, so I'm gonna try to go as slow as possible and uh, small chunks of, of mileage. So I'll see you guys. Let's get it. Let's go. Mile 130. Mile 130. Mile 130. This is my favorite road. It's always empty. There's rarely any cars. <sighs> Mile 135, mile 135. We're gonna go home, rest, rehydrate, refuel, and uh, go for the last five miles of the day to close out the day with 35 miles and total mile of 140. Let's get it. The bagels, cream cheese, peanut butter and jelly, rice, avocado, impossible meat, all that stuff that get my leg going every day. It feels good. Guys, these shoes right now are winning. Even more comfortable than the Pegasus. Come on. Okay, I want to love you so much, but you're hurting my right foot. I don't know why. I don't know. Mile 140. Mile 140. Done for the day. Good morning, my beautiful people. We're about to start day five. Today was a late one. We usually leave at five in the morning. Right now it's almost nine. I was so tired I had to sleep in, but it's going to be a late one today, but we got to get it in. Stay tuned. Let's get it. Let's go. Mile 145. Mile 145, mile 150. Guys, a quick update. It is humid. Look how much sweat. Um, I can't, let me see. See, that, that's disgusting, but I just gotta push through. We only, we only got 10 miles in so far today. We still got 25 miles to go, what? But we got this. Guys, I'm thinking about using a treadmill. Um, the heat and the humidity, I'm losing a lot of water. Just for safety reason, um, I'm trying to see if I can get access to a treadmill safely. If I can, then I'm gonna try to run some miles on that. And I'll, as well, I'll still continue outside whenever it's best, but let's hope I can get some treadmill because um, that would help a lot. All right, stay tuned. I noticed my speed is going faster because I'm with you and it's comfortable. It's so funny how the mind works. But if I'm by myself, going slower than this, I struggle. It's so weird. Mile 155, mile 155, and this beautiful rain. Okay guys, so um, I have a family friend that decided to let me use their treadmill. So I'm over here. Um, we're gonna try to get at least five miles in. It's very humid outside. I'm losing a lot of water So this will help me retain some water as well Treadmill feels like three hours long. It hasn't been an hour yet Mile 160 All right guys running on a treadmill felt like it was three hours and it was only one hour so it helped a little bit, but not that much. It's the reality of it. Mile 165. Guys, the park is beautiful. Since it rained, there's no one. It's empty. It's just, it's just me. Just me enjoying this beautiful nature by myself while running. Let's go. We're going for mile 170. Mile 170. After that, 
not 175. Then we call it a day. Then we get up tomorrow. We repeat and we get up on Sunday. We repeat and then we're done. Let's get it. Let's go. Woo! Mile 170. Mile 170. Today's a late one. It's dark out. I don't think GoPro can pick me up, but it's been a late one. We started late. We gotta finish late. Mile 175. Done. Day five in the books. Two more days to go. 35 each day, right? We can do it, guys? I think so. Let's get it. Let's go. Good morning, my beautiful people. We're about to start day six. I'm nervous as ever because today, because it's so hot, it's been hot lately. I've been sweating a lot, losing a lot of water. I'm already sweating. If you see my nose, my forehead, that's how high it is. We started late again, but um, we'll do our best. So stay tuned for more. See you guys soon. Mile 180. Guys, when I tell you it's hot, it is hot. Look at me right now. That's only five miles. Um, took us 55 minutes. And uh, it looks like I ran a marathon. Like the amount of sweat I got through. Humidity is insane. Um, but we're gonna be smart because it's about safety, you know? And uh, I'm gonna go recover uh, and uh, refuel and see what we got in us in the next 30 minutes or so, all right? See y'all soon, let's get it, let's go. Mile 185, guys, I am, I'm in a little bit of pain. I'm just drained by the sun. But see, I, I feel like I look miserable too, right? It's the sun, the sun is killing me. Mile 185. Guys, so my uh, neighbors across the street, son owned, I'm um, port owner of a, a UFC gym. So he happened to be by when I was coming back from a run and I talked to him and um, he's allowing me to use the gym and use his treadmill because it's so hot. It's like high 80s today. And I uh, shout out to people who ran the marathon in Doha not too long ago. It's insane, it's so hot. So I'm here in front of um, the gym and I'm about to get as much miles in as I can inside and maybe take the rest out. We'll see, I'll let you guys know. So stay tuned for more. See you guys soon, let's get it. Mile 190, mile 190. Man, so, so blessed and grateful to be able to have a, access to a treadmill. Cause it's hot, it's hot out there. It's hot out there. Mile 190. Mile 195, mile 195. Actually, 205 is coming up. Mile 205 is coming up. And then we go to mile 10, 210. And then we're done for today. And then we got 35 left tomorrow. And then we're done with 245 miles. That sounds good to say. It's been a struggle, but we're gonna get it. We're gonna make it there. It's been a struggle. Guys, we're gonna take a pause because you gotta check out what my neighbors did for me. Check this out. All right, we gotta start this. Hold on, let's pause. It says, go hella with a big smiley face. You got this. <laughs> hella strong, wow, that's amazing. Keep moving. Dream big. See that? Dream big. Mile 200, mile 200. So I'm taking a quick break because of my neighborhood. I saw these two cute kids writing this beautiful message for all of us. Um, this is them right here, they're my neighbors. And then I just came to this. Um, this is very important right now. I feel like uh, this is something that we need to talk about. And uh, in order for all lives to matter, black lives have to matter. So that's what it is. And it's all about positivity. It's all about love and caring for one, one another. It's not about hate. So remember, we're one and we're in this together, all right? Let's get it, let's go. Mile 205, mile 205. Mile 210, mile 210, mile 210. Good morning, my beautiful people. We're about to start day seven of the 245 mile challenge. I'm excited and nervous, but let's just get started and get to that over with. Let's get it, let's go. Guys, we just started day seven. Um, by the end of today, we should complete 245 miles. 
I'm excited and nervous at the same time because I know what the struggle that's gonna be ahead for the next 35 miles. That's the reality, but at the end of the day, we can't be scared. We just gotta push through it and give our best. When that happens, the result that we want will come. Let's get it, let's go. Mile 215, mile 215. The cool temperature does the magic trick. It feels so good to run right now in a, in a cool temperature. I'm comfortable. Yeah, it feels really good. It really does the trick, cool temperature. I'm so grateful for you today. It's in the mid 60s, breezy, and I don't feel overheated yet. So, let's get it. Good morning. Hey, come on, Forrest, come on. Yes, sir. <laughs> he always says run, Forrest, run, whenever I run by his house. Fun times. One more mile. Ten. Nine miles in, so we get to 220 for today. Mile 220. Mile 220. Mile 225. Mile 225. Mile 230. Mile 230. It's doing a saddle. Ah, it doesn't matter though. <laughs> Mile 235, mile 235, mile 240, mile 240. Guys, we are about three, a little over three miles away from hitting 245 miles. Man, three miles doesn't sound bad compared to completing 242 miles, but right now, it feels like it's so out of reach because we're so mentally tired and physically, but this is the time that we gotta dig through and uh, I'm gonna dig through. Let's get it, let's go. My beautiful people, this is the best feeling ever. We're on the last mile of this challenge. We're almost there to complete 245 miles in seven days. Thank you guys for coming along, but stay tuned for more. We're not done yet. And we did this for much bigger than just a challenge for myself. You know, there's always a bigger reason behind everything we do. Let's get it. Let's go. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> ah, let's go. Mile 245. Done. Mile 245, baby. Let's get it. Let's go. We'll wrap it home though. Let's go. Ah, we did it. We did it. Let's go. Let's go. My beautiful people, thank you so much for coming along on this 245 mile journey in a week. I dedicated each and one of the individual run to someone who's been innocently taken away from us. If you follow me on Instagram, you'll see those people. And uh, it's about us being equal, it's about equality, it's about us as a unit, so remember that. I also want to give a huge shout out to Gymshark for helping me throughout this whole journey. I have all the best fitness brand clothes that I have to keep me going and comfortable. And uh, this thing, guys, whoop, I told you guys, stay tuned for more on this. It showed a lot about my body, my recovery and all that stuff, so stay tuned for that for the next future video. I appreciate you guys. I'll see you in the next video. Let's get it. Let's go, baby. Love you guys.